I've not performed well in my first year as technical director. What should I do next? Summary, I've been the technical director of a project. It finished well, but I made some mistakes that I don't know I can fix easily. This also ruined my manager's trust in me. Should I go back to a technical-only position or even quit? I'm 32 years old, with seven years of experience as a software developer for three different companies. I started working in my current company 18 months ago, after applying for a software developer position. At the time of the interview, I also informed the interviewer, the current manager of the unit, that in the near future I would like to start a path in technical management, looking for more responsibilities. After three months of software development, they offered me the position of technical director for an incoming project, a physical product combining both software and hardware. For these kinds of projects, the top-level figures are a product manager to share the needs of the industry, a project manager to keep the deadlines under control, and me, apart from 50% programming. This role also concerned activities like feasibility analysis, making decisions on which software technologies to use, evaluating suppliers in terms of proposed technology, not pricing or sourcing, risk analysis, and preparation of the activities for the production chain. I accepted it and started this path followed by my manager. My performance was initially really good. I've enjoyed these responsibilities, most of the activities were new to me, but after a few months I started making some very stupid mistakes, one time I was asked to propose a solution for a known limitation. This required knowledge of a particular topic that I had never worked on, so I asked the help of another team with experience in this regard. They proposed a solution that, in the end, was not the right one and I've been blamed for trusting the decisions of other people too much without actually validating them. Pure forgetfulness, I did not indicate that a particular software change was needed to enable a core feature of the product. No one, including me, noted it until the pre-release. Then I took my responsibilities and fixed it. During the development phase, I didn't inform the team of a decision of mine on a low-level aspect of the software. It turned out that it was important to share this with others. In the end, the product was released on time and with everything in place, but my rating and trust from my manager has dropped due to these episodes. My manager and I both think that these are very negative aspects for the position I've been assigned to. I'm not sure if the manager is still open to analyze and correct. A new project was presented to me earlier, and no new person has been asked to work on it yet. At this point of low self-confidence, I don't know how to proceed. I'm thinking of them as behavioral issues, not technical, and this scares me since they might be part of my attitude, not something I can study to learn. Is it a reason to say, I am not the right person, on the other hand, I'm still feeling very confident on a series of aspects. Many times I've received appreciation from different people I've worked with. Also, I've demonstrated to be very proactive in the research and development of ideas or ways to optimize the internal processes, compared to people that just do what they have to do. But, maybe, this extra work might be one of the reasons why I've missed some core tasks. In this company it is very easy to stop and ask to go back to a purely technical job without repercussions. But by doing that I will unlikely be able to grow on those aspects anymore and I don't think I'll be so motivated as before. Is there a way to recover with my manager and continue on this path? Or are these kinds of mistakes so difficult to correct that I should stop here? Could HR be helpful in this situation? Relax. The project came in on time and on budget, so you succeeded. Everybody makes mistakes, mistakes are how we learn. If you make no mistakes, then you learn nothing and you don't improve. The proof here is that you're being given another project, so you are not seen as a failure. Resolve to do even better this time. I have every confidence that you will not repeat the same mistakes.